Hello, Aqua here again. This is a little short video in Creative um, about drawbridge doors. Now, Corey sent me a message yesterday saying do a video on making a compact drawbridge door. So I had a quick look and then I've, since I've done this, I sent me a message back saying you do a video. So he did and uh, Corey's got a video on his channel which I'll link in the description of this video. This is my take on it. Um, he said make an EFO door but make it as compact as possible. So I've made it as compact as humanly possible yet yeah. um, the diamond blocks don't actually move it's just the four gold blocks that move and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make another one here I've got the area laid out uh, it's possibly a little bit more expensive than it needs to be because it uses a lot of wireless this is the control for that there and I'll do that as well so I'm going to set up a fresh one over here I'm going to start off with the pressure plates so for the pressure plates what we need is I didn't mean to do that at all is we want a um, wireless transmitter there and there. Now these need a channel, so I'm going to give these three. That the channels on that one are door, a door A and door B. The channels on this one over here are going to be three and four. So I'm going to give that three. And I've not got a dirt block, have I? Let's get a dirt block. Dirt block, dirt block. On top of the dirt block. I did have a dirt block. I want a shorty pressure plate. So just to show you when you step on the pressure plate that'll turn that on. That should be fine. And now what we're gonna add in here is a receiver there. Keep pressing the wrong button. Want a drawbridge there. And then a couple of temporary blocks, just uh, so I can build on two. Okay, want a drawbridge there, drawbridge there, and a drawbridge there. So there's our four drawbridges. Now the trick to making this compact is using wireless, and the nice thing about the wireless is that you can. The way Chicken Bones has done his wireless, you can cover it, and it, um, it covers perfect. Now I'm just going to use a block there, and um, right, iron block, fly full, iron block, iron block, iron block, iron block, iron block. So that's all the iron blocks I've used. Now, if you're doing this, you could go one wider, and the, 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 you need these gold blocks, or the diamond blocks, should I say, or something similar. But I'm not going to actually use the diamond blocks, I'm going to use, I'm going to have extra covers making a little edge on the inside of the door here and what these are going to do these are going to be a platform to put my wireless receivers on um yeah wireless receivers so the wireless receivers have to stick against something so they can't be floating but what you can do is they're sticking against that cover there so receiver should click that one round receiver and we're going to want one up here Receiver. Now these I want set to four because I set the transmitter down down underneath to three. So four, four. And I just need to get that one again. Change that one to four as well. So they're all set to four. Let's cover that up again. Oops. So in in this case. Those extra covers there are acting the same as what the diamond stairs are doing in this one. So there we go. And now all we need to do now is cover them up. So we'll go around and use the um, covers. Oops, didn't mean to do that, but it doesn't matter. So just cover up all the visible sides of the um, wireless receivers there, like so. Go on, cover, damn it. There we go. And then, just, uh, just for completion's sake, let's put one there as well. So, that's everything compact and covered. Now it's a case of making your drawbridges look right. So, a block of iron in that side. Two blocks of gold in that side. And let's get some more gold. I'll get me a stack yet. Cool. So, you want block of iron a 
Damn it. Come on. <sighs> Block of Island each. To make them look like iron, and then two gold in each for the actual dove heart itself. There we go. And now it's just a. <sighs> Rick's flown up at everything. One of them, two of them, stop dicking about. That can go, that can go, that can go, and that can go. So that's everything done on that side. Now all there is is the red net part of it. So this can go anywhere. You can have this buried underneath. The reason why I've, I've kind of done this as uh, the way I have is we've only got one block underneath. We could, we could have gone one block underneath here as well. I've gone two underneath for the transmitter, but we could also have added the transmitter to a side and use the cover, depending on what your floor is, of course. So um, it's compact underneath as well. We've only gone one deep. In fact, I will do that just on one of these. What I'll do is I'll move that just to show you that you can have it this, this all one depth. And uh, I'll put that this side. There we go. So you can see that trigger in that. And then just a grass cover. Grass. That's the side. Grass block cover. Will that cover right? Look at that. Chicken bones is a genius. Um, actually, it's actually sided as well. Awesome. If you put one of them up, up right, it'll look right if you want to the side it'll look right brilliant um, oops. there we go then so that's just to show that you could have this only one depth as well so you'd have to go too deep and now yeah the other bit then is the red knot control so this can be anywhere this could be behind a wall or under the ground wherever you want it basically all we need is red knot programmable controller one bit of red knot wire and then a receiver and a transmitter connected to this one and one of them and these need to be the opposite of what they are there so this one's going to be four and this one's going to be three and then four wants to be inverted so what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the colour of one of these I'm going to change the colour of that to orange and what we're going to do is we want to invert four so all I need to do is go there go to inverter and we want output input output rear and um, so back so just so you know what's going on here, up, that's that. down, up, right, left, back, forward. So we're going input, output, back, white, inverted. So what's that done? That shut the doors. Let's get rid of that block. Go away, block. That shut the doors there. And then we want the trigger to change that to be the orange signal so we'll change this side to input output back orange and now the transmitter there under the pressure plates will fire three which is orange which will open the doors for us there we go why you no work why you no work that's hard wet what's going wrong on this side I've not reset the thing. Let's try again. There we go. So there is your as compact as possible ether door. So this is if you're going to do it like if you had a glass wall, for example, and you didn't want to go in a brick, you could go into the glass, do it like this. If you did have a solid wall, you could of course have the transmitters on this side so if you had a solid wall going like out this way anyway then you can of course have the transmitters the receivers should I say it, there instead and then you don't have to have these that negates the need for these things here because you could just cover that up um, I, don't, I think they actually look alright though the these little edge bits I think they add a bit of character to it maybe I don't know well, of course that would be up to you so if you had a solid wall there you wouldn't need them bits um, and of course if you had a solid roof a uh, solid wall above it and that as well there you go compact as possible as you see if you haven't got a wall there you do need that just so that's got somewhere to sit against 
So break that one. Put that one back. Let's keep it tidy. We'll put them ones back as well. And put that back there. Put that back to four. And uh, cover it up again. Then we go back to how it was. So compact T4 door using Tinker's Constructs, Drawbridges and um, Manufactory Reloaded Rednet. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye.